Demna Gvasalia is the creative director of Balenciaga and head designer at fashion collective Vetmol. The Georgian designer's vision has infiltrated fashion, streetwear, and everything in between. He has put DHL, IKEA, and Crocs on the runway, and is responsible for some of the biggest shifts in the fashion zeitgeist of the past few years. Here's everything you need to know about Demna Gvasalia. Demna was born in Soviet Georgia in 1980. After civil war broke out in the country, he and his family moved to Dusseldorf in Germany. Gvasalia originally studied economics, with the intention of becoming a banker. Faced with a career in finance and the prospect of becoming what he described as the most unhappy person in the world, he instead decided to study fashion at the Royal Academy of Fine Arts in Antwerp, Belgium. Previous students at the Royal Academy include Dries van Noten, Chris van Asch, and Hader Ackerman, as well as honorary alum Martin Margiela. Graduating with a master's in fashion design, Gvasalia went on to design womenswear at Maison Margiela before moving to Louis Vuitton, working under both Marc Jacobs and Nicolas Gasquier. Demna's time at Margiela left a lasting impression on him. One recruiter for the house even described Demna as Margiela's spiritual son. In 2014, Gvasalia launched Vetemont. The design collective was initially made up of seven members, including his brother Guram, who handled the commercial side of the business, as well as Russian stylist Lotta Volkova. Vetemont's aesthetic was characterized by rough, uneven jeans, ironic slogan tees, floral dresses, and double XL outerwear. The brand's offbeat look was combined with street cast models and shows at unconventional locations, like underground sex clubs and Chinese restaurants. Vetemont brought a new wave of energy to the Paris fashion scene. After just two seasons, Gvasalia's brand was nominated for the LVMH Prize in 2015. The brand made headlines with tongue-in-cheek pieces like DHL t-shirts and massive Titanic hoodies, which were later worn by unlikely streetwear aficionado Celine Dion, who sang the movie's theme tune. Kanye West was spotted in one of Vetemont's metal-inspired hoodies, and even attended the brand's Spring Summer 16 show. By Fall Winter 16, Vetemont's collection included references to Justin Bieber, new metal, and American football shoulder pads. Gvasalia has also drawn from his time living in Germany when designing for Vetmol. He made Polizei police jackets and tributes to Ramstein, and has used other German phrases like Weltschmerz, roughly translating to world pain. Back in October 2015, it was announced that Demna would be replacing Alexander Wang as the creative director for Balenciaga. His vision for the house was similar to his work at Vetmol. He brought mundane clothing, unconventional advertising campaigns, and dadcore styles to one of the world's most prestigious luxury brands. Since Demna joined the house, he's put $850 luxury Crocs, IKEA-inspired bags, and insane triple-sold sneakers on the runway. For Fall Winter 17, the designer paid tribute to US presidential candidate Bernie Sanders. Gvasalia reworked Sanders' logo into Balenciaga's runway show, which even got the brand a shout out on CNN. Did you ever, did you ever think <laughs> that you would become a, a fashion icon? <laughs> no, not quite, Jake. Demna's work is always making headlines, and one of the designer's biggest moments was when he put a luxury version of IKEA's 99 cent Fracta bag on the runway. IKEA even fired shots at Demna's homage with their own adverts for the bag. And soon, Instagram was flooded with people making their own novelty IKEA products, as people shredded their bags and turned them into everything from thongs to sneakers. Balenciaga's Fall Winter 18 show featured a mysterious phone line that led to nowhere. But it's not all jokes and catwalk memes. The same season included a collaboration with the World Food Program, which was matched with a $250,000 donation to the charity. Demna Gvasalia will go down in history as one of the first designers to truly understand internet culture. His runway memes are designed to break the internet, and his outrageous items ensure that he's one of the most talked about designers working today. However, as his recent collections speak more to earnest ambitions such as ending world hunger, 
perhaps it's too early to say what the long-term influence of this outlier fashion designer will be. For more on Demna Gvasalia, Vetemont, and Balenciaga, head to heisnabaidi.com.